Hi, I'm Gary Patterson, TCU head football coach, and this is the Mountain.TV. Brett Brown and Ted Sundquist here in the studios of the Mountain. We are 10 weeks into the college football season, and we have a showdown between, yes, I'm saying this, Wyoming and TCU, two undefeated teams in conference play. Big game, Ted. You may need this, Brett. It was a really big game. I don't know if you guys know, but this is a Wyoming Cowboy grad right here. I'll use these. Let's get to the highlights. <laughs> Huge game. You know, the elements were supposed to be a factor. It didn't turn out that way, Ted. It did not. There was supposed to be snow and rain, and in the first half, at least, there was a lot of sunshine shining on those frogs' rear ends. Absolutely. Running down the field, Matthew Tucker, 7-0. Horn Frog strike first. Two Wyoming possessions later, Brett Smith hooks up with a fellow freshman, Josh Doxson, to lock the game up at seven. Now the Cowboys play some defense and get the ball back. Smith's a double, a dual threat. He really is, and then one of the things that impresses me about him is he knows when to run, when to tuck it, and when he does, he becomes a running back. This isn't a guy looking to slide. Speaking of a threat, how about Josh Boyce? Makes a man miss, gets it down to the TCU two-yard line. Very next play, Ed Wesley caps the drive off with a two-yard scamper, easy enough, 14-10. 2.30 remaining in the second. Red Smith hangs tight, hits Maziak Bana. Nice pass, Ted. Yeah, a really good pass, and Abana goes up and takes it. He climbs the ladder there against the young safety, comes down with the score. We got a ball game. Now, I thought this was huge. Right before the half, Paha -ha picked off. Yeah, they, they, Wyoming chose to blitz right there. They, they called a timeout. TCU did. It gave the defense time to adjust. Pressure Paha. -ha. He throws off his back foot. Interception. Second half, Horn Frogs wrote this running game, Ted. Yeah, they did. That trio of backs, all of them just about rushed for 100 yards. I think at the very end it was 180 to 140 to 90. When you've got three backs that can run, oh, look out. That's ugly. Brett Smith takes a shot. How bad is that? Well, I'm telling you, they had pressure on him all second half. Eventually knocked him out of the game, and that's what that was really the only thing that slowed down the Cowboy offense in that second half. Because the snow sure didn't. Despite five turnovers, the Horn Frogs ride the ground game to its 21st consecutive Mountain West win as they hold off the Cowboys 31-20. It'll be all right, Brett. It'll be all right. 